Hi, we are engineering brothers and I have chosen this is our 16th problem of additional problem and uh, this problem is very very interesting over here you can see that the two ohm sorry the two henry and one henry are connected parallelly and along with this one another inductor is connected parallelly but here we need to find out the value of l for the condition of the ratio or say uh, for the inductor value will tends to infinity that is our main problem over here and we need to find out the equivalent reactance or equivalent inductance over here okay so if i take these two lines say 2 henry and 1 henry what is the equivalent inductance value for that so this one is 2 henry and this one is 1 henry if i take the equivalent inductance value is say l equivalent so this is l equivalent so what is the equation the equation is it is same with our resistance 1 okay so what is the formula for that l1 l2 divided by l1 plus l2 and if i take the l1 is 1 and l2 is 2 if i put those values over here so what i have got which is 2 by 3 henry okay so the l equivalent value is what this value is 2 by 3 henry okay and this one is eliminated and only one inductance is present and we have considered or we have named that with l equivalent so we no longer require these two parallel path as i have successfully converted these two inductance or parallel inductance uh, arms into only one single arm and along with this one the L Henry is present over here okay and our ultimate problem is very simple we need to find out this value of L for the condition of the inductance values are going towards infinity okay or equivalent inductance value are going towards infinity so what we have got so if you say the l equivalent final for these two parallel path what we have got if i take the inductance value is l so what is the equation the equation is the same equation if i put this formula over here once again what we have got so this is our equation okay and next one is very simple if i divide both ratio or both upper portion or both numerator and denominator numerator and denominator with l what we have got the equation is look like this one so 2 by 3 l this one is 1 okay and if i do consider that the l is tends to infinity what we have got if I take this 2 by 3 L, this is present in the denominator and if I consider that 3 L is equal to 0, so what we have got? The ratio will be 1, 2 by 0 which actually gives us the infinity. Okay, so this expression is turned infinity. So I have told you that for the condition of l tends to infinity we have got this is our expression so if i put this expression as zero which is our main preferred solution over here so what is the final equivalent inductance value for our consideration which is 2 by 3 divided by 0 plus 1 and what is the value the value is 2 by 3 henry okay so this is our final equation that we have got over here 2 by 3 henry so the answer is 2 by 3 henry 
Okay, I want to repeat this portion from the beginning. First, two Henry and one Henry are connected parallelly, and after I have successfully converted this parallel circuit into only one sing single circuit or on only one single equivalent circuit, and the that value is two by three Henry, and two by three and L are connected parallelly, and our ultimate problem is to we need to convert this or we need to say that the value of l should be goes to infinity for our condition so what we have got the this is our ratio if i take l is equal to 0 for the condition of 0 we have got this is our infinity so this actually gives us the maximum value for our equivalent inductance factor as i have considered this is our zero so for this consideration or for this condition this equivalent inductance factor is tends to maximum value which is our main fund over here and after i have put the condition for our condition of the inductance value which is maximum if i put this ratio which is zero so 2 by 0 means infinity or any number divided by 0 means infinity and if I have put those values over here I have got the final answer is 2 by 3 Henry so for the value of 2 by 3 Henry the inductance values are tends to 0 okay or it will maximize the ratio as the 2 by 3 L are present in the denominator portion or in the lower portion of our ratio in order to increase this factor we need to decrease the denominator okay that is why we have considered this ratio as zero and if i have put the condition over here i have got the value of inductance is 2 by 3 henry okay so i think i have covered this mathematical or say uh, the circuit theory solution over here if you still have any doubts let me know in the comment section below hit the bell icon for more updates and stay tuned to the channel and don't forget to subscribe our channel because this type of uh, problems are altogether very very special and i am doing it by my own convenience or by my own graceful style or my own way that is why i am always giving you very challenging or mind-blowing problems that will increase your confidence level to face this type of conceptual solutions or conceptual problems or you have understood my total analogy if you still have any doubts let me know in the comment section below so that's it thank you and goodbye